we have so much to talk about too, y'all. This weekend, we were celebrating Brennan's birthday. Mm -hmm. uh, we did a beach birthday. trip with all of our friends. So we're gonna tell y'all all about that today as yeah. well. Hey y'all, it's the Southern Snackers. I'm Emily. I'm Bucky. And I'm Brandon. And today y'all, we are eating Show Mars, uh -huh. which is local here to Charlotte, NC. It is kind of like a, Man. they got, y'all, they got everything, oh, but yeah. they specialize in like Greek food. They got some pitas, some gyros, some burgers, seafood. salads, seafood. Y'all, yes. they got it all and it so, is so good. And we got it all today. Did y'all show them the logo? Southern Fresh Greek. That's uh, yes. the slogan, y'all. Yes. And y'all, it is so good. So, I'll start with what I got real quick, and then y'all, we're just going to get to grubbing, because I think yeah. we are all starving <laughs> today. Shaking. I know. <laughs> and we have so much to talk about, too, y'all, because we actually... This weekend, we were celebrating Brennan's birthday. Mm -hmm. uh, we did a beach birthday. trip with all of our friends. So we're going to tell y'all all about that today as yes. well. It was fun. So y'all, I got what's called the original pita burger. So y'all, they put burger on pita, and it is so good. Look at that, y'all. <laughs> Look at all that meat. Oh, That's my God. Crazy. It's two patties, and they cut them in half. Because Emily was like, oh, my God, how many? Is that like five <laughs> patties? I was like, well, they're cut in half. Oh, my gosh. That then looks it makes good. It, it, so it's got cheese. lettuce, onion, and tzatziki sauce on it. I got some fries, and then I got, y'all, they have this bomb. Um, black bean and corn salad. It's really good. It is so good. I got he two sides of that. And then Bucky and I each got a little kids meal. Yeah. So I got a chicken tender kids meal. Here are my tenders. And then y'all look at all this ranch for dipping. We have so much. And their so ranch is sources, actually so really good. Sources. Grilled chicken pita. There we have a fish sandwich. It's supposedly the best well, fish sandwich. The best in the world. I mean that's what it said online. So we'll see about that. Some shrimp. Hummus with pita bread to dip in it. Ooh, it's gonna be so good. Hummus um, sounds good. All right, y'all. I got a salad, a Greek salad pita, honey, with some Greek dressing. Their fries are so good, y'all. I got some coleslaw back there. I don't know if you can see it. I don't think and I a can bunch know. of ranch because their ranch is so good. There's they gave me a little cup of coleslaw. That's like a little dollop of coleslaw. <laughs> but I'm starving. Y'all ready? Oh, yeah, I'm ready to grow, y'all. Mm. <sighs> some Greek dressing. I love hummus. Especially like pita bread. Oh yeah. So Y'all, this black bean and corn salad, like I wish I could get the recipe. And it's so simple, right? It's like mm -hmm. so fresh. You got two of them. I love it that much. Mm. Yeah. Now, are these ranches? Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay. They got good ranch. Mm. Yes, mm. they got good ranch. Oh, so good. You know I would not come back with that many ranches if it wasn't good. Okay. Mm. 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 Y'all, I love Shomar so much. There's a bunch of ketchups on there too, if I'm anything. Mm. Ooh, this is good. Yeah. Where's oh, that tzatziki sauce oh. at? Oh, it's on there somewhere. Okay. That pita looks good too. So, y'all, like they were saying, we just got back from the beach uh, mm -hmm. yesterday. So we're all a little sun kissed. <laughs> we are, we look good. My shoulders and back are currently itching mm -hmm. like really hard, really bad. <laughs> really hard. Cause I got sunburn. Anyway. This is like the first day that we've actually filmed like mm -hmm. early enough in the day. That we where we're, we're actually gonna post it on the same day. So y'all are seeing us Monday. It is this Monday, is Monday at the lunchtime. April, 15th. I don't know what the date is, but. This has never happened. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. This is the first. Oh my God, that's cool. You're seeing us in real time. Yeah. Well, yeah, Kinda. a couple hours off, but yeah. <laughs> but we had so much fun this weekend. Yeah. Oh my goodness. I'll we ate bit. some good food. Oh yeah. Mm. You gotta tell everybody where we went, B. So let's start, let's start from the beginning. Mm-hmm. What do you mean? Well, let's do Thursday, our whole trip. Let's go. Let's just talk back. about everything we did. Yeah. Back, back to, to the, the beginning. <laughs> okay. So Thursday, me and Bucky and our friend Anna drove down. They rented this big house, y'all. We we've got a, another edition of our cribs coming soon. <laughs> yes. Where we're gonna show you the house, y'all. It was mm. crazy. It was so nice. It was like what seven bedrooms. Seven bed. Eight every bath. Be every bedroom has had its own bathroom. It had a big family room, a big game room, mm -hmm. uh, nice big kitchen with two fridges, like beautiful views of the ocean. And then y'all, we had our own private 
spa and oceanfront pool yes. which if you saw our live i think when did we go live friday night friday that was friday night, night. But then you saw the pool and how we were all like illuminated and all the colors of the pool <laughs> it was cool it was fun um so yeah so thursday night we went down uh we got to the house we checked it out we went and got groceries you know the, you know how you when you get to vacation you gotta go to make, make that trip mm -hmm. oh yeah um we just kind of hung out in the pool ate some chick-fil-a yeah then we hung out in the pool that night Kind of relaxed. Then we played some Golden Girls Monopoly that night. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then Friday we woke up, got ready for everybody else to get there, that kind of thing. Because mostly everybody was coming down Friday. Mm -hmm. Right. Woo! That is so good. So then Friday we went and had lunch. We went back to the store, got some more things we needed because we were doing... Um, we decided Saturday during lunch to do like a cookout. So we did that. I mean, isn't that really all vacation is? Just hanging out. I mean, and eating literally, yeah. Mm -hmm. In like a new location. Mm-hmm. It was just so nice because it was like on the beach. So you woke up and you just like oh, were so beach bright. Oh so then Friday gosh. night, everybody kind of trickled in. Mm. Um, I was supposed to have a show, oh, um, yeah. a gig, <clears throat> and y'all, you know, the rain was awful. Like where the gig was, so they actually canceled my gig. So it worked out because I actually got to hang out at the house more with everybody. Mm hmm. And then Friday night, we just like hung out in the pool. We got a lot of pizza. We went live on YouTube later. It was a late night. Had a few drinks. It was so fun. And Saturday morning, we all got up. We all hung out at the house. We, went, we got in the pool. Then we had a cookout. We cooked burgers, hot dogs, all the sides. And then. Mm. Saturday night, y'all, we all went. We got dressed up. We this was Brendan's like, main thing he wanted to do. Because I've never been there and I had to try it. Mm -hmm. Well, your but mama we said went. that you have been there. No, it's not the same. Okay. Anyway. So, um, we went to... Now you made me lose my train of thought. Lord. <laughs> you Why can't you gotta interject like that? <laughs> Uh, <laughs> where did we? Oh, we went to oh we went to Paula Dean's Family Kitchen in Myrtle Beach at Broadway at the Beach, y'all. Mm -hmm. It was so good. Have y'all heard of Paula it's Dean's? Family style. Who has not heard of Paula Dean? No, like the restaurant. Oh, I was. Like, <laughs> anyway, y'all. Well, I guess if you're maybe international, you might not have heard of her. This shrimp is good. Sorry, y'all. Yeah, it's family style. So the way it is is like you go to a big group. And you order like three meats and like four veggies and you get unlimited amounts of this. So we have fried chicken, meatloaf, and spirit and ribs. And then for our sides, we have mac and cheese, collard greens, cream corn, and splash casserole. And we all got to pick our own little dessert. They have these gr like banging garlic cheese biscuits that like put Red Lobster to shame, y'all. Yeah. Like no joke. I know. They were so good. Yeah. So good. Um, but yeah, everything there was great. Then we went and had some drinks, some drinky drinks at a bar there, some slushies at Fat Tuesdays, if you've ever been to a Fat Tuesday. Uh, and then after that, we went to the club and we danced all night. Mm -hmm. And you know, then we got back about three. We Some of us hung out in the pool for a little while mm -hmm. longer. Then Sunday, we woke up, we got everything together to check out of the place, and we went and have, all had breakfast at a pancake house. Mm -hmm. And it was just a really fun weekend. Yeah. What was your favorite part? I don't, honestly, probably just like hanging out in the house, mm -hmm. you know, just like being there with everybody. Yeah. I agree. And then I loved, I loved like going out and all like eating together and like all slaying at the Paula Deans. Yeah, Paula Deans was so fun. They had like this lazy Susan in the middle when you just spin it to each other and get your food. All right, y'all, this is supposed to be the best fish sandwich. Yeah, and Bucky got no tartar sauce and no coleslaw with that. Because that's nasty. Oh, but you got some ranch. I'm gonna there put you some go. ranch on it. That works too. Emily was worried about my sandwich being too dry. There oh, is tartar sauce out there. There's cocktail sauce. I just don't like that. I do love ranch, though. So that's this kinda... ranch is so good. Mm -hmm. mm. That was probably the fastest storytelling I've ever heard. <laughs> like, I, I literally thought our story time would take this the whole, whole video, video. <laughs> and Brennan got through this and like. So fast. I was like, Lord. Well, I mean, there are other we'll I mean, some details. I'm though. trying to think about, yeah, right, what are some of the details we can talk about? Mm -hmm. What are some funny things mm. that happened? Hmm. Yeah, is it the best? How are you feeling about it? I don't know that it's the best, y'all. It's good. There's nothing, I mean, it's basic. But Captain D's fish was a lot better than this. 
time. But that wasn't a sandwich. But putting that on. And that also wasn't flounder. Is that is what that is? Is this flounder? Yeah. Oh, okay. So you can't really compare them. You can when somebody says it's the best fish sandwich. <laughs> I mean, maybe. I didn't say the best flounder sandwich. It's good though. So y'all about to bite into my pita burger. I want to try that. Mm -mm. <laughs> mm. How's everything going over there? Oh my God. Too good. Look, my plate's almost empty. Oh yeah. I'm slaying y'all. Well, if you want any hummus or anything, holler at me. I'll let you know. Is is Shomars, that, is that. Where is Shomars? Is it only in NC? Oh, yeah. I don't know. I think it's like, I think they have locations in other states. I'm not positive. Well, we know there's one in Shelby. So it goes beyond Charlotte for sure. Yeah. But other than that, I don't know. Let us know if y'all have one. Mm -hmm. It's really good. Oh, we were texting, and I was like, we haven't done Mediterranean food yet. Which, I guess this counts, right? That's what Bucky said. He was like, uh... <laughs> I mean, I guess it's like a southern fresh I was like, yeah, let's do, like, let's do Mediterranean food. <laughs> it's a southerner's take on Mediterranean food. We literally got food. popcorn shrimp, a flounder sandwich, <laughs> chicken tenders, a, a burger, burger, black bean and corn salad. I got Greek salad. You got a Greek vegetable. Almost so. Yeah. Is that Mediterranean, I guess? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like Greek. Mm. What else on the burger? Tzatziki? Lettuce, onions, and tzatziki sauce. Hey. Yeah. Oh, I have something to say. Hold on. <laughs> Well, has something to say. Well, since it's food related, me and Ernie went and our cake tasting last week. And y'all, oh, yeah. a couple of the layers of our wedding cake is going to be funfetti. Let me know in the comments below if you are married and had a wedding, what your wedding cake was. I would love to hear. That's a good question for people. Because you can really do anything. And I didn't know that. How big is it going to be? It's going to be four tiers. Okay. But, you know, you keep the top tier for your first anniversary. Yeah. But the bottom layer is my Oh, yeah. You... Yeah. What did, she, what did she tell you? I forgot. Our friend had a funny story about her top tier. A year later, she and her husband went to eat it. And it was like amaretto flavor, I think she said. And she said when they went to eat it a year later, that it tasted like rubbing alcohol. Like somehow over the course of a year. That's so weird. The flavor changed. <laughs> but y'all have what? Funfetti and what's the other layer? Red velvet? Mm-hmm. With cream. You better tell me with cream cheese. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> so is it just straight up Funfetti cake with like, with like Funfetti icing? Mm. So, <coughs> y'all, it's, it's not going to be the... Uh, funfetti mix, like, you know, you eat whenever you make a funfetti cake. It's like white cake with sprinkles in it. So, it's going to taste really good, but it's also for the look. Yeah. yeah. Um, and then, it's going to be buttercream and then like some raspberry. I tasted it at the place. It's really good. It tastes kind of, it sounds kind of like weird. Raspberry. You, you can't always taste oh. that. Who you didn't plan your wedding cake around brain. Oh my meals? god, you know I hate raspberries. How dare I? <laughs> How dare I? No, it's really good. And it's a really thin layer of like, I don't know, I have to ask Ernie. Like a raspberry preserves or something. Kind of, but it's really, you don't even really taste it. But it, that cake tasting was so much fun. Because I didn't know if that was real. Because you know you see that in movies, like people go to take cake tasting. Uh -huh. And I was like, but I don't really know anybody that's ever done that. But we got to do it. So what do they do? Do they just have like endless amounts of cake to just bring it to you and you just try it? They have it in like cupcake form? No. So they brought us each a plate with, um, I think it was. Why well, do you have to choose which ones you want to try first or? No, she just brought us out a sample plate. It was like six little pieces of cake, like little slices. You know, you don't get a big uh, piece for each kind. That would be legit. But no, just little pieces. So you can sample each one. 
one red velvet was on there and then the white cake that she's going to put sprinkles in was on there what else with the try? raspberry and the um, buttercream we tried an almond, well, which I didn't love. Praise God you didn't pick that. Um, a chocolate. <laughs> oh, praise God you didn't pick that either. Yeah. <laughs> what else? I, I don't love chocolate cake, and then Ernie's not a chocolate uh -uh. fan. Yo, and I then, do not like chocolate cake. I don't either. I love chocolate. Um, and there were a few. There was like a, there was like a white cake with like some chocolate in it, like a mix, and then oh, I forgot what the other one was. But, and I think there were more, but that was just kind of like the basic sample. Um, but the red velvet but was so good. But did y'all kind of go into good. it knowing what you probably wanted? We knew Funfetti. Yeah, we knew, because that's my favorite cake. And everybody loves red velvet cake. And y'all, it is so good. I mean, that's like the one, that's like one cake I feel like that most everybody likes. It's like cream cheese buttercream. Um, I think it is so good. Mmm. Mm. Woo! I devoured this so fast. <laughs> Bucky Slade. That fish sandwich, that pita, that shrimp. They've still got some shrimp left. The pita dip or the hummus dip. Lord have mercy. Those fries are good too. Oh my God, their fries are the bomb. Crinkly cut. Oh. That noise. You always talk about the noise, and then that noise was weird. <laughs> when you bite the bottom, you have to suck the tzatziki sauce out. Or it'll Do you get... have to? I mean, it'll just run everywhere if you don't. <laughs> I do kind of look tan. What are you giggling at? Oh, yeah, we got some... um. We got some pretty tan. Well, I'm kind of more burned, but. <laughs> Can I try that burger patty? Sure. Can I try some of your fish? Oh, wait. <laughs> You're too late. Mm -hmm. Hmm. <clears throat> the meat's good. Like, mm -hmm. the burger's good. Yeah. And y'all, they do have Beyond Burgers at Shamar's, but Emily doesn't like Beyond. Y'all, I got it one time. For vegetarians. And the taste is really good, y'all, but it looks so much like a real burger. It freaked my freak, y'all. But isn't that what Burger King's going to start having? What? Really? Remember you sent me that One link? of them, is, yeah. That's cool. Honey, Burger King is always ahead of the game. They've had a veggie burger for years, but it's Morningstar, so I guess it's now It's weird that like, the one. other places don't. I know. I agree. Especially in today's age. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You'd at least think that. I don't know. I agree. Cause like, I'm surprised they don't at least have it and then just charge more for it. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Which I would get, you know. Because, like, I thought like there are actually a lot of people out there who love a veggie burger. Oh, yeah. Y'all. I mean, I like a black... I mean, I've had Burger King veggie burgers good, but mm -hmm. I like a black bean burger. Yeah. Like, that's something that I might order. Like, I've ordered that before, like at Chili's. Y'all would probably like the Beyond Burger. Woo! Oh, that was delicious. I know. That was so good. You think you eat that? I'm going to take it for later. Oh, yeah. So, it's just corn, black bean, green peppers. It's corn, black bean, green peppers, tomato. Uh, red peppers, onions. And then some kind of like whatever they put on Vinaigrette. it. Vinaigrette. It's so good. Yeah. That looks like something Emily would love. You introduced it to me. We went to Show Mars together one time. I know, I couldn't believe it. You <laughs> never got years it. Ago. I, like, I hope you never got this. It's so good and it's like bitch friendly. It is good. And it's like healthy. Mm hmm. It's simple, <laughs> yeah. Mm hmm. Woo. Oh, it's just so colorful and like. Yeah, it's pretty. Crunchy. It's so fresh. Mm -hmm. Like. That's what I love about it. Yeah. This was so good. I know. How long have we been? Oh. I know we ate so fast. <laughs> we were starting. No, we don't even have to edit though. Oh, well, I'm not editing no. this. We're just going to slap it together, y'all. I'm putting it together, <laughs> slapping it on, putting our intro in it, and then <laughs> y'all like are going to have it. <laughs> 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 y'all, I did edit for the first time. So, Emily, when she does her solos, she does it in iMovie. Oh, yeah. And I've never used iMovie. 
but we were down at the beach and we had that Krispy Kreme video to upload that we did on Friday. And I didn't have my computer, I didn't have uh, Final Cut to edit it. So I did it on my phone in iMovie and I was like, this must be like what it feels like for him. <laughs> and it was like, like so feel hard like to like. I was there? Yeah, it was like, because like splicing like clips and stuff. But you see, I do it on my iPad. Okay. So that may be a little bit easier. Yeah. It was just like so hard me trying to like move my finger. To, like, <laughs> but I think like a lot of screen. YouTubers just exclusively use iMovie. Oh, I yeah. think so, yeah. I mean, it gets the job done, you yeah. know. Yeah. Isn't it what like Tyler Amy like uses only? I yeah. think so. I mean, I think it's good, like, unless you're going to do, like, hardcore, like, editing. Anything like fancy or... Yeah. yeah. Like, mukbangs and stuff, I don't see why you would need any, like, fancy program or... And I'm, it, this is a good thing, to, because some people have asked in the past, like, what do y'all use? And I yeah, said yeah, I just yeah. use iMovie, but I know y'all yeah. do something a little more advanced, but... So, you, you think that for mukbangs, just iMovie's fine? Yeah. Because I think that, too. Yeah. Um, you know, unless you're doing some Shane Dawson stuff. Right. You um, probably are fine with iMovie. Because I'm sure, like, because I do some green screen stuff in our videos as mm -hmm. well. And I'm sure you can do that on iMovie. I don't know for sure. but Probably. Um, I don't know. It's just, I just know Final Cut, how it works even better than iMovie. Really so it's just easier for me. Yeah. Um, but y'all, I think we are done. That was I'm, so fun. We're going to wrap this I'm up. So I'm going to upload it. And we're going to send it to you as fast as possible. We love y'all. Yes. This was good. Thank y'all so much for watching. Thank you for liking, commenting, subscribing, and for following us. We love all you guys. Yes. We appreciate it so much. Be sure to put a comment below, interact with us a little bit. Yeah. Answer Emily's question about what wedding cake you have if yeah. you had a wedding. If you have not had a wedding, then answer what is the best wedding cake you've ever had. And if oh, you're still watching yeah. this, you are a true ride or die. So put that hashtag ride or die down in the comments below so we know that you've watched all the way up until here. And y'all, Brennan's birthday is this <coughs> Thursday, April 18th. As you're burping and I can't. It's all, I don't know what's so happening. So make sure you reach out to him at some point and wish him a happy birthday. Yes, y'all. Yes. Just remember when life is tough. Just keep on snacking. Bye, y'all. Bye, y'all. Thank you.